Hello traders, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I will be talking about buy and sell stop limit pending orders in MetaTrader 5. First I will explain the theory how it works and how we use it. So let's say that we want to sell from this level here only if price go below here. That means let's say if we want price to go here then a sell limit is placed here and then when the price goes here the sell positions are opened. The opposite is for the buy side. So let's say that we want to buy here only if price goes above here. So when the price goes above this level here the buy limit is activated here and then when price goes down the buy positions are opened. I uh, personally use trading box order management that helps me place these stop limit pending orders very fast. So for this I select this supply level and click S box to change this rectangle to order box. So order box is virtual market order. Then uh, I will set target and enable this on button which give me sell on line. Now I can go here to order function and click limit. See now sell stop limit is placed. And now you see even if I disable this or maybe move this to somewhere else it doesn't matter anymore. Let me now explain. So here okay let me just hide this one first. So here you see here is sell stop limit and here is sell stop limit. So now means that when price will go below this level this sell stop limit will be changed into the sell limit. Also the stop loss was placed and the target here take profit was placed. So this is how you can very easily very quickly place stop limit for sell. Let me now delete this one and do the opposite for the buy side. So I click here this rectangle and change it to order box. I set my target here and uh, go here more click button on which gives me buy online and now I click a limit and buy stop limit is placed. So you can see here this order is now placed. Now when the price will go above this level here this will be changed into the buy limit. Okay, delete here. And let me explain something else. Before I was using the pending order but if you want to use the virtual market order then it is enough to just place this online uh, set your target here this online here and now when the price will go below this sell online then this here sell button will be activated and this whole order box will be activated so when the price go from here to here the sell positions are opened. I can quickly demonstrate you. Let's say that I move this sell on above the price. You see now this sell is activated. And if I move this down to the price, you see order is opened. So this is just how I simulate. 
Okay, now I can close this position. This was just to show you how it works. So if I make now some conclusion, we can have stop limit pending order and we can have stop limit market order. So pending order we can achieve with this limit and on line like this. But if we want uh, to have a market order, we just leave this here and this whole order box will be a stop limit market order.